I'm not vegetarian, but sometimes you just want different options. You know, sometimes I might go 30 days with no meat, or sometimes I might go a day or just want to try it. So let's see what it's about. If it's nasty, if it's good. By the way, I've never had an Impossible Whopper anywhere. I think they have them other places. Don't ask me where. Okay. Smells. Smells? Like no smell. I asked for it with no mayo. I don't know why they would have mayo on a Possible Burger anyway. Um, especially if you're real vegan, because that's not vegan. But I guess if it's just vegetarian, I don't know why they would have mayo on it. They need some ketchup. I got enough ketchup on it. So I like ketchup on my waffles. So I'm gonna try it and we're gonna throw this away because I don't eat all of the extra bread. I'm scared to taste it. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's see. Oh, I didn't really bite it, did I? Like, if you was not paying attention and if you have some cheese on it, <coughs> bless you. Like, if you was not paying attention and you had some cheese on this guy, it would halfway, it would halfway fool you. Like, if I just gave this to somebody and I had some cheese on it and maybe they was sleepy or something, we ain't gonna say they under the influence because we don't do that kind of stuff. They wouldn't know that this ain't a Whopper. I mean, I know, but I don't know. It ain't like them burgers you have and you be like, ooh, it tastes like fake meat. Is it the flame boil or is it the impossible? Now I got to go somewhere else and try an impossible because I don't know if it's the flame or the impossible. But y'all go try one, Burger King. Not sponsored. <laughs>